Good evening and welcome back once again. Um, if you watched the last match, we actually lost, which if you're a regular to the channel, that does not happen a lot. Um, but yeah, we're going to jump straight back into the team. We need to bounce back from this. Um, we're still top, but you know we don't want that to turn into two or three losses in a row. So let's see how we get on. So this is going to be the start lineup. We've got Pope and Goal. Vardy and Botman, it's centre defence. Destin Davies are back in it at the wing backs. Declan White in defensive mid. Um, got Brian Hill coming on for a start again. Bellingham and Gumaresh. And then Liao and Isaac up front. So Bellingham pushed a little bit further forward than he has been sometimes recently. And I think Brian Hill really deserves that start again. Yeah, so like I said, if you watched the last match, it was a disappointing game. Did we deserve to lose? Um, I don't think we deserve to lose. We didn't play that great, but it is what it is. Um, got to take it on the chain and just improve in the next game. Um, so certainly want to want three points in this one, but more importantly, well, not more importantly, but you know we we'll need a better performance. Got a corner at least to start with. Nice tackle from Des there, and gives it back to Brian Hill, who uh, I think he got tackled off or bounced off his heel or something, maybe. Nice tackle from Davies there. Gets it back from Bellingham, but again loses out. Gotta throw a no, keep the pressure on. And I said it in the last video, but not long until the transfer window now, which I'm um, looking forward to. Have to see what sort of money we've got to play with, though. I don't think it's going to be much. Rice. Oh, well wide. Sliced it, I think. Yeah, well wide. Yeah, we've definitely got some money to play with. Um, you know, we've got more than enough budget for the team salary. Uh, I'll have to double check, but I think we've maybe got about over 10,000 sort of over that balance of spare. Obviously, you have to take into account that any new player you get, you need to get pay for their salary as well. Um, what the one from the other, but he needs that support. That was, is that not a foul? Oh, close to being a foul to me. That's a poor ball. tackle will look looked a little bit dangerous there. Looks like they could catch us on the counter attack. Oh all sorts of defending shenanigans going on there. That was all just down to them really. That's a poor ball. Really poor. Had plenty of margin for error and Who knows better than that? Bit tight there. Bruno straight at the keeper, and somehow maybe another own goal. Yeah, their, their defense looks a little bit shaky. Let's put it that way. <clears throat> it's a terrible pass from Bellingham there. 
again, the one thing about I'd like to improve is this. It's not necessarily scoring the goal, but sometimes that that finish, that pass, it's just sloppy sometimes. Um, I want to get that less and less. Isaac. Oh, how did he miss? Oh my god. How did he miss that? Oh, oh it's miss of the season. Oh, that's a shocker. That's not going to be on a highlight re reel that you want to be on. Isaac, no. Ball out wide to Davies. That's quiet. It's not a great ball. Not a great ball. Okay, get a corner out of it, which is a little bit lucky. But again, just the way of the game. And um, whenever AI defense clear the ball, it always goes to their player. Pretty much 95% of the time. And you know, it's not a clearance, it's actually a pass. Hill, 1-0, and that's deserved, and I'm glad it's Brian Hill because he played so well in that 7-3 win that we had in the Cup. He got three assists, should have actually been four assists, um, and he didn't manage to get a goal in that match. But one of the match, um, but he deserves that. Nice ball in, nice little swivel, and what a finish though, right into the top corner. Going to take a piece of quality to get the breakthrough in this game, and it's happened just before half time. Now, don't make any mistakes in defense. And Brian Hill chasing him down and winning back the ball. What's that? What? That's not a free kick. It goes out anyway. Um, no way in hell that was a, a free kick. But there it is. Half time. Happy that we got the goal. It was hard going at times. We'll jump back into the second half. So yeah, what we need to do is close out this game. We'll need another goal for a cushion, but more importantly, don't let any slip-ups happen in defence, which we've been prone to be doing recently. And I'm not sure why that suddenly crept into our game. Bellingham. Did I take a deflection or? Oh, I think it did, didn't it? At the last second? No? <sighs> Lovely attempt. But from that yard jet, you know, it wasn't like hit really uh, powerfully. I'm not sure how it wasn't, um, you know. You'd be questioning the goalkeeper if that had gone in. I'll just let it overshoot there. Nice ball out wide though. Need to keep possession a bit, be a bit more patient, and that's not how can I say that? Honestly. Clear on that. It's actually went to our player for once. Come on, I need support here. Oh, Isaac, come on. How didn't he score there? Bellingham did all the hard work, laid it across, and 
he's actually seemed to take an age. Trying a little bit of skill there, but probably not the right time to do it. Good tackle. Gonna make some substitutions soon. Let that go out. Right, let's make some substitutions now. Okay, so we're bringing on Jamal Lewis, St. Maximin, and Rainer, and Davies, Bruno, and Isaac are going off. And Belling has gone into more central role. Um, Reina going out on the uh, the left there. I don't know how. Great save there. Now, again, that's the quality of Pope. On another day, well, if that was Carrius, that's going in. Bellingham, 2-0. And that is a lovely finish. He's just moved into that central position. Pope has just saved us at one end. Go straight up on the counter-attack and get that killer blow. And the hour with the assist. Lovely you know, perfectly into the dry, one touch, opens up his body, lovely finish there. Bellingham doesn't score that many, and um, when he does, they're normally a good one. To be fair, he normally plays in a, a deeper role, and he has been playing in, in sort of this game. Levering it there, I don't care where it goes. I'll run the ball out there. Comfortable save there from Pope that time. So this has certainly been a better performance than the last match, and well, I don't want to jinx it, but uh, you know we're taking our chances a little bit better. <clears throat> Just slightly mistimed that pass. That's got to be a foul. Great tackle from Bowen there. Doing that thing again though, where it doesn't matter what you do, you can't get the ball off him. I just won the ball back and he's literally on his feet within like a millisecond. Right, get the ball this time though. Maximum nice ball out to the out. Good save. Now down the angle. I wasn't sure. Don't think the chip was the best option. It might have been. out short to Jamal Lewis. Now Rainer, who hasn't seen much since he came on. That'll be another corner. Goes over everyone. That's going to be a goal kick. Just really kept running with it. Well, that was close. Not that would really mattered in terms of the game itself, but that could have been a consolation goal, which we didn't want. So we've kept a clean sheet, which is great. A lot better performance. Still a bit scrappy in areas, but I'm happy with the result. And Bellingham man the match. You wouldn't you wouldn't argue against that, I suppose. Brian Hill was really good as well. The L5.5, is that all? Yeah. Um, 
and the subs, yeah, okay. But yeah, I, I would agree with that. And Nick Pope got a 6.5. I mean, massive turning point in that match. 1-0 up. Pope made a magnificent save. We went on the counter-attack and scored that killer second goal, and that made all of the difference. So, you know, having a world-class keeper in Pope starting, um, whereas Karius had been previously, simply because of uh, international duty, that choice was out of our hands. Yeah, we need a really, really good quality second-choice goalkeeper. That's, we're going to have to have a look at that. But again, guys, that's it for this week. So thank you very much. If you did enjoy this video, please like, leave a comment down below, and subscribe if you can so you can watch more videos in the future. And go check out my channel. There's other games that I play. Um, it's mainly PES 6 and PGA Tour 2K23. Some really good stuff on there. Um, but thank you very much again, and I'll speak to you all soon.